Hi, and welcome to the Middle Room Workshop. Today, I'm going to show you how to cut a large piece of uh, plywood with your laser engraver. Without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, today I've received my uh, new sheet of plywood. Uh, the thing is that once I receive it, I have to cut it down so that I can work it out with my laser engraver that as you know is, has a working area of about uh, 400 millimeters times 250 this is the uh, Nege uh, Master 2S Plus so I wanted to share with you how I go about cutting this into the right size now as you might have noticed I'm uh, living in a flat so it's not an optimal place where I can actually grab my jigsaw or any other noisy equipment and to start cutting. So I basically came around and found that I can actually lay this thing flat, put the machine on top and I can use uh, the same laser engraver to actually perform my cut. So let me show you how I do that. So the first thing I do is uh, to basically place the machine on the ground to align all of my protection mat so that I'm not going to basically uh, damage what, what's beneath the machine so that could be your floor or parquet or a carpet like in my case and then to ensure that you have enough space on the floor so that you can lay your sheet of plywood flat onto the machine All right, once you are done with the arrangement, uh, you can basically design a simple L-shaped line, which corresponds to the uh, cut line, and you can basically uh, send it with the settings to cut through the thickness of material that you are intending to cut. So in my case, I'm going to use uh, light burn. So I'll simply design um, an L shape over here escape then I will select it just to set uh, use the select tool so I will select it just to set the um, approximate dimension uh, so I'll put a width of 250 and a height of 400 that's approximately the dimension of the board that I want to produce and click on escape and here we can set up the parameter for the cutting now I'm uh, going to cut 3 millimeters uh, play wood so 100 millimeter per minute speed it's fine and 90% power is also okay and that's basically all I want so then uh, you will basically frame it and you will try to align as much as you can with the board and once you are happy with the alignment and with everything you will click on start
All right, and once you're done, you will basically be able to uh, remove your cut part from the uh, large sheet. Um, you might need to apply a little bit of force in case some part didn't cut perfectly through, but in general, with the 40 watt laser module, uh, that will be more than okay. And this is the way you go about it. It's something very simple and handy that you can do, so you don't have to basically deal with uh, your jigsaw or uh, a circular saw. And the other thing is that uh, you are not going to produce any mess of uh, uh, sawdust and so on. So everything is going to be smoke, basically, as long as you have your room ventilated and you are good to go. Alright, I hope you liked the video, you have found it helpful. If you liked it, click the thumb up button below. If you have any comment, leave them below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this one. Ciao for now!